All right. Um, this is another video. As I said, I'm going to try to make as many videos as I can before I can't. Uh, but it is taking a lot of my, you know, time and it's draining my energy. And, but I understand the necessity for it because the way I'm looking at me making those videos, to me, the reason why I'm making this video is because I understand the limitation of, uh, of uh, my future limitations. And I wanna, I wanna make sure that when I'm not even here, that's what I said is somewhere, stored somewhere. And my stories, my, my, what's happening to me, my testimonials, you know, recorded. These people, I, I think they just get into a situation where, oh, we're winning. We win so much. We won. I'm like, uh, it, it's like children that try to find winnings in, in things that just, it's like, um, it's like looking at the sky and see like the blue sky. It's like, oh, we won. It's blue. I was like, there's no winning or losing. It's enduring. There's not gonna be any. This this there's no winning. You these people will never actually win in this matter. This is not a winning or losing matter. The reality is, I'm gonna be a target individual, and most likely till the end. And that means that a lot of things that I'm gonna experience are gonna be manipulated. And if I get to the point where my brain is so ravaged that I. It's um um, I I think in in these ways is because my brain is so ravaged. This is also why I make these videos. And you know a lot of these people, because of there's no winning or losing. It's just obvious that everything is just manipulated. They like want to leave off what <laughs> the torture that I'm gonna experience, because I'm validating that they force you to. To, to get all these different manipulations. I've been, this is 200, like close to 200 videos now, if not, of me saying systematically about uh, literally saying the same thing over and over and over and over and over. And backing that up with validation from others. Everything I'm experiencing has been said by others. So these people who obviously try to block this obviousness, their job is not to is to continue to do their job. If they get tired, somebody's gonna come and do their job. You know, like it, it's just, I understand. But I'm not gonna let you leave your fantasy. I'm gonna call out everything they do to me. The manipulation they want me to ident identify me to experience. And then you walk by me, you see me, you face me, you understand, do you, do you think I subscribe? Did you, you think you're acting maybe subscribe to these manipulations? Now they tell me how I'm going to scream, I'm going to be tortured, I'm going to be castrated, you know, all the worst. Things. Because to them, it's like, you see, we, that's, so yes, because I'm a target individual. These horrible things are going to happen to me, I understand. And it makes it even worse because these people who want me to identify with the things that they manipulate me to experience, wants to create a theater. It's like, this person who's tied down, who, who refused to accept this thing, oh, let's burn him. He's gonna accept it. No, I'm not. Oh, it's gonna look like it's true then because we're gonna be, no, no, it's not. You're just burning somebody who's tied up. This is, the, the, that's the mentality these people have. And they try to, to tell themselves things to just normalize what they do. It's like, oh, we're, we're insane, huh? It's like, no, you do very, very nasty, disgusting things to people and you try to cope with it. And you have told yourself in certain ways. You're not mean, you're cowards in low lives, but you're gonna get yours, you, you know that. You're gonna get what's coming for you as you are doing these insane things that you do to people. But the most insane thing is them trying to get me to subscribe to these things that they force me to experience. That is truly insane. You know, um, I made a video not too long ago. But before that, um, they, I woke up from dreams where this pure pedophilia conditioning. Oh my gosh. It's like they give you sensation when you're sleeping, stimulation. 
and dreams that are just very much just kind of reshape your brain, rewire your brain to think in these pedophile ways. I can feel it. They're trying to really make me accept these thoughts. And like, oh, we're insane. Because we do these pedophilia things. So insane. This is the state of mind they, they, they have. We're so insane because we force you to be stimulated toward kids. We're insane. And try to use this menacing voice. You understand how disgusting these people are. And they try to even sound fierce about it. It's insane that not only that, but you also work for a bunch of entities filled with pedophiles. That's insane. You are correct. But most importantly, what you don't want to call yourself, which you know you are, is trash. You're trash. But they try to be like, ah, oh, we're so bad, you know, we're so insane. <laughs> we'll make you simulate our kids. That is the kind of mentality they try to have when they do these things to people. No, I see you truly for what you are, look, nasty trash. But it's okay, there's no coming back from what you, 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 they use the easy route to enjoy, to, to feel special. That route means you sold your soul to pedophiles and now you're insane. And you're going to be watching me burn and die while, you, while your life is going to be so much better. I don't envy trash like that. Trash. Who condition people to think in these pedophilia ways and then try to manipulate them in these bizarre ways. And try to use fear of torture to make, to make them subscribe to these things. You know, they were making me think of all these things that they, they said it's going to happen to me. But one thing they've been trying to do is they say that they're going to frame me. Once I'm framed, these horrible things are going to happen to me, right? I'm going to be in circumstances where I'll be around people who are going to do physical harm to me and they disgusting things. And absolutely believe that's going to happen. You know, I believe in that because I know that they... They have been humiliated. They've been humiliated to the nth degree. But the, the humiliation they have to they've gone through is they torture children sexually in other ways. And it's been testified about it, right? And it's the same people. It's, they're not different. They're the same program that does that to kids. They torture women in these terrible ways, including sexual torture that is nonstop. These people try to create this facade of avenging women that's just protecting the you know, avenging women. It's embarrassing because you're in a program that does so much horrible things to women, including including a lot of sexual torture of all sorts. And this is very consistent. Now, the way they force people to think about children also very consistent they have been using pedophilia type of tormenting to manipulate people to break them down very disgusting then the entities that construct this trash have a lot of pedophiles in those agencies it's a pattern of issues in those entities that they're contracted by now, in the midst of me saying that, they tell me, oh, it's going to be horrible. Why are they saying that now? Because I just said the things you just heard me. You heard me say. Entities that contract these people are filled with pedophiles. They torture children sexually. They torture women sexually. They do the pedophilia type of tormenting. And they're renowned for it. And those entities that contract them that gives them the power to be insane are filled with pedophiles. These people are trying to cover that up. So the theater is going to be horrible. You understand what I just said? And these are people who are trying to present themselves, who wanted to live that fantasy of this femme fatale, like this just said. This fantasy of fierce, progressive, and just like daring when in reality they're cowards 
trash, bottom feeders, working for entities that torture babies, women, and do the pedophilia type of torture. Not even entity, sorry. Work for a program. They don't, they don't even work for the entity. They work for a program that torture women and children. And some of them talking to me have done that to women and children. Right? They are truly cowards. When you see them in person, they are truly what you expect. People who are involved in this. Cowardness mixed with trashiness, mixed with low lifeness, mixed with degradingness. Just like gimmickiness, oh, if do you see that because they're involved in that, that's that's the kind of that's what you see. Um, and it's just disgusting. Now, for me, they're like, oh, they saw we they saw this. They called this thought. They called what just happened two seconds ago. They, they called this manipulation. I'm like, who? The people going to torture me? Wait, you tell me. That. You, as cowardly that you, and nasty and, and, and quote unquote insane person that you are, if you are involved in manipulating my brain in these pedophilia ways, you tell me those insane people cannot be involved in the same way you are involved or fully aware that my brain is conditioned to be thinking this way, manipulate to think in this way, and forced to feel this ways. And perceive things in these ways? Of course I know. They will do this. They will be involved. If this trash as these people are not they level of trashiness is just like everybody like these people will be like, oh my god, this is so real. Let's let's cut him up. No. They're gonna be okay, we're in. Let's do this. Um, we'll go do the same thing. And we can try to make him believe these things are happening organically. We, we're gonna hurt him because he's a target individual or we got benefits from that so this you know they, it's easy if, you, if this trash can do it people who can actually physically do things to me can easily do it but they want to use this like we've proved this so much that these people gonna hurt you it's like there's no the, i know the reality of things everybody your whole ecosystem know how things are working in your brain they know that things are being manipulated and they're gonna hurt me because this these people these perps who hurts me remotely are just cowards and trash so people who are still trash and low lives can hurt me physically knowing these things is falsified just like this trash who manip literally works day in a day out to condition your brain literally hands-on working on manipulating your brain to think in these pedophilia ways and try to sell you this that's you they're gonna hurt you, they're gonna lose like, yeah. But they know that I'm not subscribing and they know that I'm not what you're trying to you know, make me be. But they're gonna hurt me, it's gonna be painful. Because just like you, who knows who I am, but it's changing me into something else. They're doing what they're assigned to do. I'm not gonna let them leave their fantasy. They, they're literally using torture, warning of torture as validation. That's how, how much they have to block our reality. Oh, it's like me saying, uh, because this person is going to stab you up or because he's going to rape you, that means you, you stole this thing over there. You stole that T-shirt that, 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 that over there. And then you have nothing. Well, what? I, I, I didn't do anything. None of that. None of that was, was, was like, none of that happened. I didn't start, I didn't steal this thing that you tell me I steal, but no, be, they're going to rape you, so that's proof. Huh? That's how they, they try to m make you subscribe to things. And so you understand, they get frustrated in a sense, but at the same time, they have the, the confidence of knowing what's going to happen to me. I'm being manipulated to the nth degree. Everything I'm experiencing is something that's been orchestrated and manipulated. You see the last video? That last video, I was like, for sure, thank God I took a screenshot. If I didn't take a screenshot of that, it would have been something else in my brain. They start making me think that this kid that was in this picture, in this whatever, was wearing like some kind of like bikini bottle. Bikini bottom. 
and truly. And I was like, what? And I was, I was like, this makes no sense. I'm, I'm, I tried to look, and it, as I'm trying to look, they tried to make me look at th this kid's butt. They literally tried to make me look at this kid's butt. And then tried to make me imagine this kid. But in this voluptuous, like, woman, like, like a woman. And I'm like, what? And I, was, I, I, I get out of there. And immediately, like, oh, you see, remember? Remember when you were saying that you look at kid's butt? I'm like, Pfft. This thing, this thing was just manipulating my brain. They wanted me to look at and then do their thing. And then I look back, this kid is wearing shorts. And they tried to be even there and try to, ugh, try to create some imaginations. And you can't even see the butt. It's just, they just, they, and try to see now that's proof, you see, we're proof. Disturbing. That's what the things they do in my brain. They're like, oh, but you know, like having these bottles that's just nonsensical. But that's what they do. They have no shame. And in my brain, it's just like, it's their world of manipulating things to however they want it. And you gotta be strong. Because they truly are gonna push you to experience the, the foulest things. I mean, they literally condition my brain. Dreams of like stimulations aimed toward children of all sorts. It's like they're, I can, I can feel my brain just and my mind and my thoughts is just being forced to being rewired. This is why I make these videos. It's just disgusting. So while I'm able to speak and articulate what's happening to me, I will. Even if I, I repeat the same thing, let me repeat that the one, one last time, one, one more time. Because me saying this, who knows who's gonna watch this? Maybe one person, maybe one, one. And that changes one person's way of perceiving, not even perceiving, the way they, they're dealing and dealing with, with, with what's happening to them, because this is real. They are forcing people to think in these ways. They use these childlike people. It doesn't take much. These, these people are not you know, recruiting the, the creme de la creme. I feel like anybody can involve. And that's why I'm so thankful too, is because seeing who's involved and participant you like everybody can really involve themselves. It just is, you don't have to be a genius. Really, matter of fact, you have to almost, you almost have to dumb yourself down to be able to do the things that you're supposed to be doing. It's like you actually have to turn down your, 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 your self-respect, your logic, your rationality, come up with a fantasy, and then you literally have to just make yourself go back and then do the things that you do. So I'm like, I'm just thank, thankful. I didn't, I, I, I didn't get into this world of day in. It's just nasty. It's, and in, in this kind of environment, people want to be radical and try to use progressive radicalness as a, as a, as a, as a, as a way to cope with what they're part of. No, first of all, if you know who put me in, my, in, in this program, you understand there's nothing radical about these people. These people are the most conservative people you can think of. That's, and they know that that's the program. That's the people who put me in this program. You guys are in the same program that does that to women and children. You can be radical what? Radical to torture children and, and women? Human experimentation led by the government? So radical. They've been doing this for decades. Torturing people and using this technology that can rewire brains in these disturbing ways, manipulating people to think in these pedophilia ways, oh my gosh. Jesus, badasses. They are disgusting. And for me, wherever things ends up, because they like to say, you're gonna die in a cell, you're gonna do this, you're gonna be rotting in a cell, you're gonna, you know, listen, uh, when it comes to the theater, which is what I'm gonna call it, and this is what I'm going to call to the end. The theater is to try to somehow maintain this fantasy they put together. It's like, oh, we're going to torture you like that, so that's true. You torture babies and women. You're the trash, you're human trash. You force people to think in this disgusting way. I can, I'd rather die starving to death in the, in the little corner. They do what you do. 
and die and just walk around and just play, play this fantasy you've put together and then they get frustrated oh they're gonna rape this crap out of you every time they do these nasty manipulations oh they're gonna rape you they're gonna do this it's like i rather get raped and then they do what you do can you imagine i'm like forcing this person to 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 uh to experience these nasty things and i'm like oh they're gonna rape you for that oh they're gonna rape you oh and then I, you know whatever i watch him this person get raped it's like oh you see <sighs> accept this thing that's you and it'll never happen i'm just gonna ask god to give me strength for this theater that i'm gonna experience because they want me to subscribe to this nastiness but in the meantime i just also thank him because i could have lived a life this slow lifeness that they, these people live i understand the enjoyment of feeling empowered of knowing I and mean, orchestrating and being and being able to to control and do all this thing to an individual but you can't do that to your life you can't you don't have you you don't know what's gonna happen in your own life so that's like sad that's the magic part that's the magical part of this the unknown of what's gonna happen to you well you know everything and involved in all kind of manipulation in my life this bottom feeders don't understand that it's just the most pathetic life they don't even want to think about it you know i talked to this perp and she likes to tell me like oh no i know what's gonna happen to you like she obviously i was like she we speak in codes we speak in in in, in ways that <laughs> you know they speak uh this is speaking in in ways that we understand each other right and she tr she says oh no my gosh I, I i can't predict what you're gonna have like you know because i'm not feeling well i tell her like i don't it's like oh you don't you can't predict what you have you know and i i get it i, I know what she's trying to say and i'm like oh oh so are you saying that you can't predict your ailment or whatever disease you're gonna get i try to bring it back to her because i know she knows what's happening to my body but she won't know what's gonna happen to her and she tried to change subject of uh, uh, and so uh how was the uh I was like, you get, you understand what I'm trying to say. I'm not trying to get to you. It's just I'm not gonna let you escape. I'm telling you that there's something biblical about what we go through. Yes, there's nothing we can do. We're almost, we're powerless against. Um, and I'm using the word they've been using because they call me, "Oh, you're powerless." It's like yes, in the sense that we're going. It's us civilians against government entities that contract this trash this perps to break us down and this trash found empowerment because in their life who knows what they can do they this you know they they, they they might not be powerless but it they live in an unknown too but when they involve in this environment oh they have all oh, they feel powerful they find control they can involve in your in your life these people can die from the can't from something tomorrow they, they won't know they were but two, three days ago they were like yeah it's where gods it's our world three months from now they can be in, in dying in 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 the hospital car accident. like you understand this is the kind of life these people live and try to block out this reality they can you know they, it's funny when they say codes they were like oh we're decoding and it's funny how they try to create a f a fantasy of a falsified reality where they could come up with their own like bs oh no we're decoding your brain you're decoding my brain you are manipulating you are controlling you are of course i know the reality of thing i'm understanding of the level of this sophistication it's just unbelievable it's fully that's why they call themselves the, the you know what they are like what they want they wish they are gods because they can do so much to somebody and i'm talking about this this program can uh, this bottom fields gave the opportunity to do this because they work for this program they can control so much of what you're experiencing what you're gonna do your behavior your thoughts this is what these people do this is this is what this program does so, um, let me know and i empower them in that way because they're employed by a program that does this these people who are employed by the program that rewire manipulate and control do this because they are contracted by this program and their job is to break you down and at some point because i'm a civilian 
with limited access and 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 I cannot protect myself against government entities that contract this trash but but thousands and maybe I'm gonna sometime at some point break break down it's just it, I understand that I, I'm I'm a human with limited resource and these government entities with unlimited resource with at most the sophistication that was unbelievable that contract thousands maybe millions of people around you not around you but just in general to do these things the, you, this what can you do and this trash they contract live in their little fantasy they don't want to live in the reality they in, even though they know they're working in it every day it's like oh our control it's our money we're different <laughs> It's just trash contracted by the government. And there, there was obviously, you know, people there who were just like, okay, this and that, that needs to be done. The same people that would do that to women and child, they have done it and do, are doing it. But they want this trash, the contractor wants to live in the fantasy. I wonder if there's even people like looking at them, it's like, look at this, they're, they're, they're retards. But good for them. They let them dream a little bit. I wonder. Because we made this is the facade they try to create. They really are trying to make me think, oh, it's different. We are a different group. We don't do that to women and children. Yes, they do that to women and children. They do horrible things to, to babies, to women. And they try to play, oh, we're doing it for, for, for this woman. It's like, yeah, okay. All the horrible things you've done to women, you can don't even even try to even speak about it. And then they force you to experience these disgusting pedophilia things. It's like, no, it's you when you're a kid. It's you. We matched it. You pee. You pay. You abuse. I'm like, what? You have to exaggerate what a child did. And then you, in a program that do horrible things to babies of all ages, trash. Uh, you know, even that alone, that makes me just very, like, want to, I feel almost aggressive when I even think of these people trying to to talk about me as a child who are in a program that does this horrible thing, this abusive, disturbing things to kids that includes sexual torture. When I see them, I'm like, I know what the, what you, how nasty you guys are to babies and, uh, and kids. And of course, a lot of them have kids, which makes it even more disturbing that they would do this be involved in this program that does horrible things to kids and then go back and try to be and be the best mothers and the best fathers in a program then go back in the program that does horrible things to baby radiating them torturing them forcing people to think in these disgusting ways you know push even bringing their kids in front of somebody who's targeted so they can force this target individual to give disgusting reactions and like our oh, kids and walk away that, that is just trashiness at its finest and they'll be reimbursed properly and for their kids they're actually tortured and tormented and who knows if they died I, I hope you know I, hope, I mean I'm sure some have died you can kids cannot survive this kind of torture for too long before they get they get sick and die so these people obviously are involved in the same things and they try to agitate me I'm gonna see them for what they're part of in every situation and they tell me how it's in their courts like yes of course i know they, this is government it's the government courts right you, you are contracted by the government right this technology is dod right everything that's related to the government is yours and not yours but the entity is contracting you and you're trash, you are trash that was, was contracted by these government entities that control those court system and every other like society system, everything. In. And this is why also maybe why there's so many pedophiles that get away with things in these agencies. Because it is their courts. So to, my, to all my target individual, it takes a lot of energy, but 
Eva died in if I die in, in 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 three months, right? I'm not gonna look at this moment like, oh my gosh, I should have not made this video. No, this is the moment that that's the the that's what I should be doing the more than anything else. Continuously testifying until I can't, and let people know and target individuals specifically. Stay strong. This trash I contracted to make you accept these manipulations. I've been told 24-7 I'm dying. This person tell me that I can be dying, could, could be dying, could die in three, in, in, even before I die. This person doesn't know. But I'd rather be dying like this and be on the right side of things than do what this trash do. These bottom feeders the government contracted. So stay strong and understand that justice will be done for the nastiness they've done to all, every, every, every target individual that have died, that have suffered, that have tormented, that have been tormented, which include women and children. And be strong, because justice will come for what they do. And the way they try to vilify you when they're involved in these disgusting things, and while they manipulate you in these disturbing ways, huh, just stay strong.